And 10 points reach is getting longer. The group will stretch its resources to the Hallville area. 24 Hour News 8's Julian Grace live in the newsroom tonight to tell us why the group will patrol the West Side neighborhood. Julian, good evening. Hey, good evening, Brooke. Well, each year I could tell you a number of neighborhoods and groups ask for 10 point to patrol their community, but the group cannot fulfill all of the requests. But Hallville residents not only requested the group, they also want to be involved in the process. The 10 point coalition stand by some keep is on the move again. This move will bring the group to the west side. And tonight, Reverend Charles Harrison summed up why. Well, Hallville is one of the, uh, uh, you know, particularly the 16th and Tibbs area, it was one of the uh, six hotspot areas in the city. Uh, some of the leaders from Hallville approached uh, 10 point about. Uh, coming over and, and helping. And share with us. Uh, well, we've seen the letters of request for help addressed to Tim Point. This after the crime fighting group established a track record in helping to decrease crime in neighborhoods like the Butler Tarkington area. And believe it or not, it all starts with one discussion. We want to talk about um, basically um, the issues that Hallville is facing, how Tim Point can be helpful, how we can come alongside of a lot of great. Uh, things that are already going in Hallville. So uh, we want to kind of get familiar with what the issues are. This expansion will not only take hard work, foot patrols and patience, but also community involvement. And that's the piece that we're saying. There is no one group, no one agency that can curb the pattern of violence alone. It's going to take everybody working together to end the census violence. Okay, so it is cold outside, right? Well, what does 10 point do when conditions outside are below freezing? I'll fill you in all new at 11 o'clock. For now, reporting live in the newsroom, Julian Grace, 24 Hour News 8.